Okay, hello everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect 2, where I'm just, I'm taking a chill, and I just felt like playing some Mass Effect 2, so off we go. Hopefully this is the way we're supposed to go. Hopefully the mic is facing the right way. Oh, life- Ah! <laughs> God dang. want <sighs> collectors want plague you work for doctor turn on machines put cure in how air. did you know that we kill you first ah. <sighs> um where are you at oh you're a pyro where's the oh he's way back there Okay, I can... Alright, I'm just like concentrating. That guy's still around! Okay, good. Vorcha heavy. Yeah, I tried to get down. Central control system is in an alcove in the center of the back wall. You can inject the cure and reinitialize the systems there. Back here? Oh, okay, good. Okay. The cure is in place. Now we need to reactivate the fans. Okay, so we still haven't. Ah! ah. You guys have impeccable timing, I'll just I'll tell you that right now. Okay. I see you up there. Yeah, that's nice. go back down. Here goes. Uh okay, good, got him. Oh. Get down, you crazy. <clears throat> oh, we still got those guys. Hang on. One out. I'm good. Shepard. All right, well, I'll just sit here, laddie dying. No, you don't got him. Give me his head. 
dead. God dang, if I had a pistol shots left, it'd be great. They are pistols far more accurate. And also more powerful. But it's not as good with the uh, armor, so. Can I save? Nope. Pretty sure. Yeah. Oh, dog. Decision. Where's the other one? Okay, he's behind. I was hoping he was back there. Yeah, we do. Why? Because that's just the nature of the game. Possible to get back there, and there's still that guy. Come on out! Ah! Uh. Oh shoot! I was hoping that would, the wall would keep me safe. behind me, but 
I just want this guy to die. Oh, come on, really? I didn't kill you. Is there somebody still above us? Or is there... Now you see me. Looks like there is. But, or no, it was just, oh, right there. He exploded. I have zero shields. It's ridiculous. I've lost shield. Uh, this is really good at taking out their armor. Here goes. Shoot, she used her power. I was gonna use it. There we go, boy. Cloaking. There we that cloaking is awesome. She's like really good at that. Let's see any? Okay. Bed goes down. Both fans are online. Morden should be pleased. Excellent. Oh, good. Can I go? Can we just boop? Yes. Thank you. Become the ultimate hero or become the ultimate jerk, whichever one you prefer. I wonder what this loading screen is supposed to symbolize. Fans? Environmental systems engaged. Airborne viral levels dropping. Patients improving. Vorcha retreating. Well done, Shepard. Thank you. And thank you for me as well. Those Batarians would have killed me. For a second there, I thought you were going to shoot them even after they let me go. I made a promise to spare them if they let you go. I honor my promises. Merciful of you. Risky. Would have killed them myself. Really? Professor, how can you say that? You're a doctor. You believe in helping people. This kid people. does not have the Lots right to talk to, to him people. like this. Sometimes heal patients, sometimes execute dangerous people. Either way helps. Go check on the patients. Lots of work to do. Think about what I said. He's not a kid, he's an adult, but he's like, has like the gall to be offended. Good kid, bit naive. He'll learn. Letting him take over the clinic should be able to handle it now that Vorja are gone. Okay. We've cured the plague. Are you ready to help stop the collectors? Yes. Unexpected to be working with Cerberus. Yeah, I know, right? Many surprises. Just need to finish up here at the clinic. Won't take long. Meet you at your ship. Looking forward to it. Ah, yes. Um, well, I need to stay on... No, I'll leave. Okay. Yeah. We're heading out. See you in the Normandy. I guess I could have I gone around and... Whoa! I actually wanted to stay on Omega, but... I leveled up! Yay! My meta gel capacity went up. Oh, but ooh, now I can do stuff. Ooh, let's go do stuff. We can get upgrades and stuff. That'll be nice. That would be nice. Floating mittens. I really want to eat some M and M's right now. I still have some mint M and M's left over from Christmas. Really want to eat some. I ate some earlier and I want to eat some more. Uh, it's just been, it's been a busy day. That's good though. It's been like good busy, you know what I mean? Welcome to the Normandy, Professor. Hey! It's an honor to have you on board. Yes, very exciting. Cerberus working with aliens. Unexpected. Elusive man branching out, maybe? Not so human centric. Were you part of the League of One? No, you weren't. But dang, nah, that'd be cool. You're very well informed. Solarian government well-connected espionage experts had top-level clearance once, retired now, still hear things. Informed of name only, no knowledge of man behind it. Anti-alien reputation listed as problematic. Mm -hmm. The collectors have been abducting yeah, colonists. Let's just kind of avoid the, the issue for now. Systems. No distress signals are sent out, no signs of attack. There's virtually no evidence that anything unusual happened at all. Except that every man, woman, and child. Jacob is always paces gas, like that. Maybe no, spreads too slow. Airborne virus, no. You don't have to sit there and guess. 
We collected samples from one of the colonists. I kind of wish I would let the like conversation finish. Figure out how the collectors did this. Yes, of course. Analyze the samples. We're going to need a lab. There is a fully equipped lab on the combat deck, Professor Solis. If you find anything lacking, please place a requisition. He's like looking on. around. Who's that? Pilot? No. Synthesized voice. Simulated emotional inflections. Could it be? No. Maybe. Have to ask. Is that an AI? I love him. I love the way he talks. Like I love that he thinks out loud. It's so awesome. I wish it when you did like the left and right trigger the actions. It let the conversation finish though, because he says cool. Look, my my scars are already fading. Like some things are really cooler said, and I'd like to overhear them. The ship is equipped with an artificial intelligence. No point keeping it a secret. An AI on board. Non-human crew members. Cerberus more desperate than I thought. Everything is information the to him. have taken tens of thousands of colonists. We'll do whatever we have to do to find and stop them. Yes, of course. Can't risk being captured like colonists need to identify, neutralize technology, need samples. Which way to the lab? Follow me, Professor. He's like, let's go, let's go, let's go! We don't got time for this! Let's see. We hear I can research things now. This thing, it's so large over in the corner, it's like, hi! Hi! Look at what you did! I'm like, yeah, I know! Morden! Morden, my man! What do you got in here? Got all kinds of stuff. Different from the medical bay. Keep this area clean, huh? <laughs> oh, I love this! I love that we're able to look like almost every room has a view into the, the heart of the ship. I love it. Hey, Morden. You got a nice view. Everyone has a nice... This is a civilian design ship. Shepard, how can I help? Uh... Is the lab working well for you? Quite satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. Destroyed most of them. Returned an expensive <laughs> one to Miranda. Nothing unexpected. <laughs> Just need more samples. More collector data, tissue samples, anything you can get, I can use. Find new tech. Uh-huh. Uh... Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on your team? <laughs> Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Always some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. But we have a doctor downstairs, so that's not, I don't think that's supposed to be his priority, so it's kind of funny that they can kind of do both. Any ideas on other ways to prepare for the collectors? Ideas, yes. Expensive, but possibly valuable. Can show you. What are you giving me? I can't, yeah! Okay, um, the ship enhancement? No, um... Oh, Morden's Omni-Tool. Okay. That sounds good. Right. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, we could act, we could, can we do that from here? Oh, yeah, research. Yeah, go ahead, buddy. Have it! Shepard, how can I help? Any ideas on other ways to prepare for the collectors? Sorry, I've done what I can. Focusing on studying collector tech now. All right, all right. Have you got a minute to talk? Of course. Plague on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with a budget. AI in particular. Very helpful. I'm glad she's Best helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with Special Tasks Group. Uh... Tell me more about the Solarian Special Tasks Group. Respected organization. Clandestine. Handles difficult assignments with limited oversight. Recon, analysis, occasional wet work, identify problems, have neutralization options ready should need arise. Model for Council Spectres based on Special Tasks Group. Very similar. I think that, yeah, and I think the first um, Spectre was actually a Solarian. Similar in what way? Solarians lack numbers. Brute strength, military prowess, have to rely upon stealth, intelligence. Agents trusted, given wide operative freedom. Spectre similar, given goal, told to accomplish. Better, funded, of course. <laughs> Didn't have to buy our own weapons. Really? <laughs> ah! It must have been frustrating working on Omega with such a limited facility. No, loved it. Limited facility presents challenge. Save greatest number of people using limited resources. Security threats, gangs, mercenary groups add additional <laughs> Quite enjoyable. Plague stretched abilities to limit. Couldn't have asked for more. Yeah, he also, solved a collector enjoy. plague. Saving people, of course. Helping the helpless, greater good, all that too. Nice. Retirement after SDG work completed. <laughs> He's amazing. Is your assistant Daniel settling in all right? Quite well. Safe and secure. Neighborhood mostly quiet with plague gone. Left him the security mechs just in case. Can't be too careful. Also tired of mechs. Noisy. Never used them in SDG. Yeah. 
You said you were in the special tasks group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert, high risk, served under young captain named Kirby. Dear, did you really? Studied Krogan genophage, took water, tissue samples from Krogan colonies. I didn't realize that you worked that closely with Kirihi. I worked with an STG captain named Kirihi. His team helped me destroy Saren's cloning facility on Burmire. Heard he was part of that. Jury rigged explosive. <laughs> Always got job done with limited resources. Good captain. Indeed. Bit of a cloaca, though. Loved his speeches. <laughs> Hold the line. Oh, the line. Personally prefer to get job done and go home. <laughs> Probably military bravado. Jargon. Chest pounding. Uh, no offense. <laughs> Why would STG study the genophage? Krogan rebellion's bloody. Dangerous. Nearly as bad as rachni attacks. All species evolve, adapt, mutate. If genophage weakens, need to be prepared. What was the STG preparing to do? Yeah. Military schematics for likely Krogan population growth. Political scenarios for attack points. Genophage reduced Krogan numbers. Species aggression unchecked. Population explosion would be disastrous. STG helped check Krogan rebellions. Needed to be ready to do the same. Simple recon. Nothing to worry about. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a good... They, they, I'm sure they've done it for everybody, you know? Like, they have attack point plans for every species out there, probably. Why would STG study Did the I already ask that? Krogan yeah, rebellion's okay. bloody. All species evolve, adapt, mutate. Uh, if genophage weakens, need to be what prepared. What can you tell me about the genophage? Bioweapon designed by Solarian science team. Deployed by Turians against Krogans to end Krogan rebellions more than a thousand years ago. Affects every cell of Krogan body. Commonly and incorrectly considered a sterility plague. Actually adjusts viable fertility rates to compensate for high Krogan birth rate. Stabilizes to pre-industrial population growth levels. I mean, they thoroughly researched it, you know what nice I mean? Nice talking with you, Morden. I should get back to work. Need to study. So much data. Here, if you need me. He's like, he does all kinds, like, he's he's in his element almost wherever he goes, I think, you know? I think, yeah, if I need to research something, I go up here. Give me more Medigel. Yes. Yep, okay. Uh, prototype. Um... Yeah, sure, why not? Uh... Oh, I can get the other one. Okay. Sure. Meh. Whoa. Whoa! Did I buy all these, or what? Uh, preventing death from all space technology based in effect on conscious soldiers. Okay. Huh, okay. Um, let's... What? Why can't I get that? Requires... Oh, I need a shotgun. To... That's right. You like, have to go in order. It's, like, really annoying. Uh... I have that. Seeking projectiles, though. Let's get that. <laughs> Wait, okay. I don't want that. I need a more heavy whim. Blah, 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 blah. Hmm. Don't worry about that right now. Uh, emergency shielding? Oh. Yeah, I want that. Jeez. Oh, come on! Oh, I thought that was a trauma module. Redundant field shield upgrade. Ah! I need da damage protection and meta gel capacity. Ah! I gotta go back to the citadel and buy stuff. Okay. Oh boy. All right. Well, we've opened up this area of the ship. That's pretty rad. Um. Okay. Let's talk to you. Morden's psych profile warned of hyper behavior, but he is like a hamster on coffee. Yeah, he is. He's going to be a very productive member of the team. Well, and I checked, they anyway, only need like. How may I help you? They only me? need like one hour of sleep. It's hilarious. Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages oh. at your private term. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need. Commander, you've received yeah, a I new know, message I heard at your you. private terminal. Okay, I have those. Oh! 
Uh, from Chakwas, command I've done further investigation regarding your facial scarring and the old adage of mind over matter holds true. Negative attitudes and aggressive acts create adverse reactions to cybernetic implants. Well, peaceful thoughts and compassionate actions. Huh. Okay, so I could, uh... I could get that. Yeah, yeah I get the, that's the med bay upgrade I could get. M's ML seventy seven. Let's go talk to see how Joker's doing. Microfusion array. Such fancy names for these things. Commander. I assume everything's going well up here. We're just having an argument over personalization <laughs> of my workspace. Cerberus regulations are clear, Mr. Moreau. Personalization <laughs> does not include grease on my bridge cameras. <laughs> It's just mad that all its footage of me looks like a dream sequence. Oh my gosh. Uh, squad. What do you think about the people we're picking up? Well, about the one... I would never... Right. I like Kasumi, but why do I feel like I need to check the Citadel for parts she may have pawned? <laughs> it's just my opinion, though. There's really no need to go spreading for it around. For parts she may have That's pawned. That's it for now. See you, Commander. I don't think there's any point in talking to Edie. I don't think she does anything at this point. We could go talk to Jacob. He might have something new to say, I'm not sure. Commander, can I help you with something? Oh, hey, yeah, we can Any get upgrades. On how to prepare against the collectors? They spec this ship to the original Normandy, but you were there. The collectors cut her like butter. This armor just isn't top of the line anymore. People will die if we don't upgrade. Alliance had some new toys in secret dev before I left. I could try and pull a few I like that he rolls his neck. He's like, yeah. Uh, heavy ship armor. Gimme, gimme. Sorry, I made Solaris armor. It's like diamond. Thanks, bucko. Commander, Boop. can I help you with something? Any thoughts on how to prepare against the Collectors? We've got the best armor available. The rest is outside my expertise, Commander. Uh... I understand you made quite an impact after you left the Alliance. Miranda and I stopped a Batarian plan to release a biological agent on the Citadel. That's when I first met her. It took us out to the Nemean Abyss. I wonder how that worked out. Save the Citadel like you, but what's the same? A good deeds like pissing yourself in dark pants? <laughs> Warm feeling, but no one notices. I'm like, yeah, yeah. The whole thing was hushed, like they're good at doing. But I know what I did, and I'm proud of it. Heck yeah, man. What do you think of the state of the crew? Well, we don't have a full complement. We don't stand a chance without the right. My arms are just like outside. hanging there. Anything else, Commander? Um, how we doing, Jacob? What's your sense of the mission? If Morden's modifications hold up, we've got a shot. If they don't, we're dead. <laughs> Seems like that He's was very a strong possibility. He's very philosophical about it. Though. Anything else, Commander? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Sounds good. Have to say you run this ship tight, and we're getting things done. We keep on track, and maybe we'll figure this out. I hope so. I'm not looking forward to the debrief if it all goes to hell. Is there something specific? Or are you just checking in? Uh... I heard you were big in the Alliance. Figured we have something in common. I did some things that caught attention <laughs> I and did some up things. the Citadel. That was after the Alliance put me on leave, though. Oh, okay. And drive a Mako through a relay <laughs> and take down a Reaper, but you covered that. Yeah, yeah. You know, you could have handled it, I'm sure. <laughs> what was your proudest career moment? Oh, uh, covered this, didn't we? It was after getting sidelined. A Batarian group was plotting to release a weaponized virus and kill the Council. Miranda and I stopped it. Strange that it wasn't bigger news. The real work doesn't get publicized, you know that. They say it's better that people don't know how fragile the system is or how close the bad guys can get. That always worries so me. It never happened. Like you and the Reaper. And that's why I'm it's here. Like, I wonder how much of that is actually real, you know what I mean? Like, in real life, like, how close does the, you know, world come to falling into anarchy? What led you to Cerberus? The Alliance sidelined me after Eden Prime. Ended up on a job with Miranda that Cerberus treated like an audition. <laughs> and here I am. <laughs> You don't seem like a results at all costs kind of guy. Cerberus history doesn't bother you? The Alliance is all politics. Somebody has to take down the bad people. Cerberus keeps that line, I'm on their side. <laughs> He's an honest dude. He's just a straight up honest soldier, you know what I mean? 
You make no apologies for doing what you had to. I admire that. I couldn't go back to the Alliance, not after the cover-up. They did the same to you. General public never knew you were dead or heard the real story. What? The really? They didn't know I was dead? Did you know they used you on recruitment ads? What? You were the human ideal for like six months. Then they replaced you with a composite image they invented. Wow. Because you didn't focus test right. Perfect example of humanity, and they still dumped you. <laughs> That's nice to know someone like you is thinking about me. What? Knowing the real story was what? hard. It felt like... Well, maybe this isn't really appropriate, Shepard. Commander. What? I should get back what? to the police. Huh? Everything has to be what did perfect I? if we're going to survive. What did I just do? I've never done that. You're not blowing me off that easy, Mr. Taylor. What? What was that? That was so uncomfortable making. <laughs> I have never once been interested in Jacob like that. Oh boy, I don't think, I never, what did I do? I was just trying to chat. Like, I like Jacob because I think he's like a bro. Like, he's just a good guy to come and chill and hang out with. You know what I mean? Jeez. Jeez. Ugh. Hold your, hold, just, just hold your, hold, rein it in, Shepard, okay? Like, we got, we got things, we got things coming. Don't worry about it. Let's go feed our fish. I probably will forget about the fish at some point in time, and they'll probably die. Are you dead yet, babies? No? Okay. I feed you. I love you. Ooh, let's check out my new ships. That's the Turian frigate. That's the Geth. Not a dreadnought, it's the Geth ship, it's the Asari dreadnought, and that's SR2, and SR1. Pa pow pa -pa pow Oh yeah, bathroom break. Whoop whoop. Do I get a shower? Nope, that's downstairs only, apparently. Um That was nice, that was nice. We had a little break in the bedroom. Uh Oh, I gotta go drop off the uh the couplings. Yeah, this one's gonna be long, probably. <laughs> That's all right. Some action, some chatting. It's all good. It's all good. I really might start eating some M Ms in a minute. Oh, uh, that's so not professional, though. It's not professional. <laughs> Let's check and see how crew quarters are doing. It's just too dangerous for them in New Canton. I'm shipping my family back to Earth. You can afford that? Yeah, Cerberus looks out for their own. They're funding the transport for me. Wow. It's the least they can do when we're putting That's our true. Lives if on he's the on this ship, they should be giving him some perks. At least to keep his family safe, you know, because this is a do or die mission. Okay, can't go in there yet. We can go poke Kasumi and see what happens. I love space. It's so cool. The stars would actually be going boom, though. Didn't I? Oh, we can ask her about these again. Okay. Hey, got a minute? Uh, yeah. Not a lot of people go in and out of Dr. Chakwa's office, other than to get medical attention, I mean. I hear you shared a drink with her. Ah. That's really nice. I imagine with all that's happened, Old friends are becoming a luxury. Yeah. Especially at her Daddy age. and Ken would make a great couple. <laughs> I just doubt they'll ever realize it. <laughs> the Normandy runs so quietly. I'm not used to hearing my footsteps when I walk. I can hear the ship engine. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. She's so cute. Like, the way she sits on that chair and everything. It's just cute. I guess we can go check on Chakwas. I'm pretty sure that nothing really changes, but we can go double check. Uh, oh, right, because you had the medical bay upgrade, too. Commander, I very much enjoyed sharing that ice brandy with you. But I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. We are on a civilian brandy ship. Straight to my head. We are on a civilian ship, Chakwas. It's nice to see you let your hair down. Guess I hadn't realized how much those feelings needed airing. But I didn't give you much of a chance to vent. So tell me now. What do you think? My feelings are my own. Everyone's depending on us. We won't let them down. They just don't make them like you anymore, Shepard. No, they don't. Well, promise me we'll share a bottle every year. The next one is sounds on me. Sounds good to me. That sounds good to me, Chuck was. <sighs> She's a... 
One of a Hooper, kind. There's something different with tonight's meal. Seems like you put in more food and less ass. Yeah, yeah. Keep talking. Hey. I love it. I love hearing the like noises in the background. It's nice. Commander, what can I do for you? Do you she have like a types and yet? talks. Of course. I'm just oh, finishing okay. an operational report. I didn't realize that we were going to have I'm more impressed, talking. Shepard. So far, things have gone exceptionally well. As Cerberus operations go, this is one of the best I've been a part of. Maybe that's because this isn't a Cerberus operation. Not to you, maybe. But I report directly to the elusive man. And I'm here because he wants me to be. Cerberus gave you a second chance, Commander. Maybe you should do the same for us. What did Cerberus do that made you so loyal? Hmm. I suppose you deserve wow. to know. Wow. She's like totally letting it all out. Do you remember I told you how I was genetically altered? Well, that wasn't my choice. I don't deserve to know anything about you. My father like, created me. It's her decision, you know? He's a very influential man and extremely controlling. He didn't want a daughter. He wanted a dynasty. I ran away as soon as I was old and brave enough. I went to Cerberus because I knew they could protect I'm me. I'm going to eat some M&Ms while we talk. Um, I don't think I deserve to know anything. Her past is her is hers, you know? I don't she didn't tell me anything she don't want to. Um, but I think she, in some way... She kind of just throws the information about herself at people just to see how they react. Um, but it is kind of surprising that her dad made a daughter and not a son. Because usually it's like, oh, sons carry the dynasty. So it's interesting that he made a girl. You seem capable of defending yourself. Why did you need Cerberus? My father invested a great deal in his dynasty. It wasn't a matter of just leaving. I knew he would continue to pursue his... Investments. Investments, plural? I assume that Cerberus approves of your enhanced abilities? Of course. Cerberus fully endorses anything that advances the cause of humanity. Genetic alterations included. But unlike my father and his own selfish reasons, Cerberus and the elusive man believe in a greater good. They see the bigger picture. And I feel like I have a purpose here. It's always good to have a purpose if you, you and that you found for herself. She found it for herself, you know? Talk about yourself like you're just a tool to be used by your father, by Cerberus. Maybe. I like to know where I fit in the world. It helps me find meaning in how I was created. You are who you are, Miranda. You don't need to make excuses for it. That's easy for you to Dr. say. Dr. Shepard. We've both been engineered for greatness, Shepard. The difference is you were great before we rebuilt you. I'm great because of it. No. You could choose to not use your abilities, you know what I mean? She's only enhanced them. Your spirit and personality are what make you great. It's what makes anyone great. That's kind of you. I'm not sure I believe you, but thanks for saying it. You're welcome. You told me a lot about your father. What happened to your mother? I never had one. Most of my genetic material is based on my father's tissue. That's kind of crazy. His Y chromosome was altered with an amalgam of desired traits from various sources. Ugh. Her eyebrows are How doing something really weird. Do you guys see the that? The man is completely egomaniacal. Just another reason I had to get away from him. Talk about yourself. Oh like wait. You're just a tool. Maybe. I like to know where you are. I who you are, Miranda. That's easy. The difference is, you were great before we rebuilt you. I'm great because of it. It's kind of creepy who that he exactly did all that. Is your father? A businessman, but a very wealthy one. It's ironic. My father believed deeply in a human positive agenda. He donated generously to Cerberus before I joined them. That's how I first heard about Cerberus, through my father's connections. Well, interesting that they chose to keep Miranda over giving her back to her father and then keeping the money. You know what I mean? Thanks for your time, Miranda. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, Commander. I am such a saint. Don't even worry about it. I mean, they're going to be cutting in and out a lot, or you're going to be hearing chewing, so we'll see how that goes in the edit. Let's go drop off the couplings. <clears throat> I'm going to choke on some M&Ms. Oh, yeah, purchase star chart. That's really cool. I like that. I need to make sure to keep on top of my upgrades and purchasing. Let's see what these guys do. Oh, come on! 
The new armor reinforcements really threw off the gravimetric profiles. But engines are good to go. I rebalanced the Gilborn coefficients and adjusted the anterior intakes on the second tier stabilizers. I love it when you talk, to her. <laughs> That's like the only flirty line he ever says to her. It's all good, though. It's all good. You're the best, Commander. We just got those FBA couplings installed. Now we only have to calibrate every week instead of every day. That's perfect. We're thinking about celebrating our newfound free time with some skilly and five poker. Want to join Heck us? Yeah. Come on, Kenneth. The commander doesn't want to play cards with grease monkeys like us. What the heck? No, man. Like, I want to take a break. You know what I mean? It's good, and they seem like cool people. Actually, that sounds interesting. Fantastic. I'll get the card. <laughs> Fantastic. You did like a jig. My skillion five's a bit rusty. It'll be easy on the rookie, right? I've been dead for two years. Of course, Commander. It's all friends. <laughs> yeah, right. Playing cards with an Irishman or a Scot. I won 500 credits. Nice. <laughs> be gentle on the rookie. I can't believe we <laughs> It's so worth losing to see you taken down a notch. Beat me up my own game. You're all right, Shepard. Thanks, ma'am. You guys are my favorite engineers ever. Don't let anybody tell you different. Oh, yep, yeah, okay, that's where I wanna go. Now we're gonna go get Archangel. Not like, you know, super right now, but in the next one. We're gonna go get Archangel. I need to play smarter. I need to use the incendiary ammo against armor. Check about the disruptor ammo. See who has that on my squad. Let's see what. Actually, let's go see what Morden. Uh, no messages for you, Commander. Team status. Incinerate. Crap. Oh, he has incinerate. I freaking love incinerate. Submachine guns and heavy pistols. All right. Oh, we are, we've already seen everybody else's. But I do have a point. I need to get that. You okay, game? Ugh. Um, The charge. Use a damaging shockwave. Uh... Oh, okay. I was like, where's the other one? Greatly increases the charge's impact, knocking targets further back and doing more damage. Focus generated by blast also briefly slows down the world around you. Giving you more time to react when coming out of the charge. Yay! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Improves your charge when just a wave of biotic force around the impact point, knocking back all enemies. Oh my gosh! Okay, so I can either slow time down around me, which means, which probably means I will also get slowed down, which would kind of suck. Or I can just knock everybody back and then book it. You know what I mean? I'll probably do that. So I could either, you know, get it, do more damage on one. And that's how most of them, when you can upgrade the abilities in two and three, you can either go, you can either go much stronger directly or have a wider area of attack, which it's nice to have a balance of those kind of abilities, you know? But, let's get my shields up. Should I get pull? Huh, or should I save? It looks like I get like three points. I think. And I'd like to the next, well. I'd like to get charge done, to be honest, so. But it's also good to get... I might need to get this because... Hmm, well, it doesn't, doesn't affect my shields at all. Yeah, I'll probably just work towards charge so I can use it more. Which means I should save that point even though it's going to be beeping at me. Alrighty then. Well, thank you guys for joining me. When we come back on the next one, we're gonna go get the Archangel. We're gonna see how that goes. It's one of my, one of my favorites. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, thank you all for joining me. I hope you didn't mind the M&Ms. I hope you had some M&Ms. 
I was watching somebody on Twitch the other day, and he started eating chips, and I was like, I need chips right now. And I actually went to the store and bought some Pringles, because I was just like, I heard the sound of chips, and I was like, I need chips now. <laughs> it was the weirdest thing. But anyway, uh, thank you guys again. I'll see you in the next one.